Welcome back to the channel. Today we're hitting both the back and biceps using just bodyweight exercises and some weighted movements. Whether you're at home or at the gym, this routine will help to target all the muscles for a strong and defined upper body. First up, we've got weighted wide grip pull-ups. This is one of the best exercises to target your lats, giving your back that wide V shape. For this, you wanna grab the pull-up bar with a grip wider than your shoulders, keep your core tight and pull yourself up until your chest reaches the bar. Then slowly lower yourself back down. To add intensity, you can wear a weighted vest or attach a weight to your waist. Aim for four sets of six to eight reps. If you're a beginner, start with just your body weight and work your way up. Next, we've got supinated pull-ups. This is a fantastic exercise for both your back and biceps with an emphasis on the biceps due to the supinated grip. Just like with the wide grip pull-ups, you can add weight for an extra challenge. Grab the bar with your palms facing towards you, slightly narrower than the shoulder width. Pull yourself up until your chin clears the bar and then lower down with control. Shoot for four sets of six to eight reps. This movement really helps to build arm strength while working the entire upper back. Now let's move on to bodyweight rows, which are perfect for hitting your mid back and rear delts. You can do these using rings or a sturdy bar. Set the rings or bar at waist height, grab on and lean back with your feet extended in front of you. The more horizontal your body is, the tougher the exercise will be. Pull your chest to the rings or bar, keeping your body straight and core engaged. This is great for improving your posture and building upper back strength. Aim for four sets of 10 to 12 reps. If it's too tough, you can always bend your knees to reduce the difficulty. Now we're moving on to shrugs. This move targets your traps, the muscles that run from your neck down to your mid back. You can use dumbbells or barbell or even a weighted backpack for this. Stand upright with your weights in hand, arms by your sides, shrug your shoulders up as high as you can, squeezing at the top, then lower them slowly. It's a small movement, but it's very powerful. Go for three to four sets of 12 to 15 reps. Focus on the squeeze at the top to get the most out of each rep. Now, no bicep workout is complete without bicep curls. You can use dumbbells, resistance bands, or even a backpack filled with weight. Stand tall with your arms fully extended, palms facing forward. Curl the weight up, making sure to squeeze at the top and then slowly lower back down. Keep your elbows close to your body and don't swing the weights. To ensure your biceps do all the work and for a solid pump, go for four sets of 10 to 12 reps. Finally, we're going to hit an advanced movement, the pelican curls. These are a killer calisthenics exercise that works both your biceps and shoulder mobility. You want to set up using gymnastic rings or a bar that's around waist height. You want to slowly lower yourself forward, extending your arms straight while controlling the descent, keeping your body in a straight line. As you come up, focus on bending your elbows and contracting at your biceps. This is a tough exercise, so you want to aim for one to two sets of three to four reps. If you're new to this move, start with your feet closer to the rings to make it easier. With these six exercises, you'll build a strong upper body using a mix of calisthenics and weighted movements. If you're consistent and push yourself with the weights, you'll start seeing real gains in both strength and size. Remember, form is key, so focus on quality reps over quantity. Let me know in the comments which exercise you found the most challenging. Don't forget to like, share, comment and subscribe for more workouts like this. See you in the next one. I'm out. Peace.